bit of a follow-up. I had a question on uh, on Discord um, about what that dampener or damper does here. So I just kind of put it back together a little bit just to show you. So on the roll axis here, which I think in the redesign I would change it so that this is um, the roll axis this way instead just because it gives more space for putting it close to your seat. But anyway, what this dampener does is that it reduces the amount of springiness in the stick because everything's on bearings and with a heavy metal grip like this, you know, it wobbles quite a lot. And it, if I swing it around, you can see it bounces back quite a lot. Whereas with the damper, it just absorbs that motion. So it's not super dampened, like it doesn't feel, you know, like, like um, you're pushing a hydraulic piston necessarily, but it just, like if I go full deflection and I let go, yeah, it just, uh, it's, it's kicking because of the force of the spring. It's a pretty heavy spring. It's like, I think that might be 10 pounds. Um, yeah. And then if I go this way, go full deflection, oh, you can see that it just, Wobble wobbles. So yeah, so that damper mechanism or that gearing um, is definitely something that I want to include in the new design. Um, the other thing I'd like to include in the design is maybe make this, like I like this slotted box system, but you know, kind of reconfigure some stuff, maybe make it so that these cartridges like dovetail in um, just to make assembly easier and for taking it apart. Um, you can see that I, I had to cut this out so I could access some parts underneath. Um, but yeah, there's a lot I'd want to change in the redesign. Maybe um, have the uh, logic, so the um, Arduinos and stuff, uh, not or like in a smaller thing, just to kind of reduce this uh, footprint. Though um, this axis. Um, has to extend this way simply because of the uh, cams and I can't really reduce bring that in because then that would interfere in the bolts the eight mil bolts well actually they're going to be eight mil right now this is imperial that's like five sixteenth that's eight mil there's quarter two these are quarter twenty like it's all intermixed so with the redesign I, I want to make everything metric um, yeah and then uh, have this be you know actually I can it's one-handed. Oh, wait, I gotta put the phone down. Uh, there you go. Change it so that this is the axis instead. Um, and now you got a dampen roll. But the dampen, the uh, damper really does improve the springiness of the stick. Like it, like it doesn't want to wobble, whereas that just goes forever. But yeah, change it so that this is the orientation so you can bring the seat closer. Um, maybe have provisions on these side panels for mounting that uh, ejection handle that I posted. Actually, let me, let me grab that ejection handle. There it is. Whoops, yeah, great, just dropped it. Have provisions for mounting this ejection handle design onto it, which would be a separate, you know, whole component and everything, but like have accessory mounting space for the back here, um, you know, have that space available. And then, yeah, this can go in the seat. And then, you know, for some designs have like a dog leg to come back, like on a extension that's bent. Um, yeah. And then I mean, one of the other ideas I was thinking for the redesign would be to have an option um, where this whole mechanism is offset. So, you know, have the cam mechanism uh, rotated so that the neutral position of the stick is slightly different. So like, you know, um, for example, on uh, Spitfire style sticks, the full forward is straight. So, you know, you don't have the full length of travel, but just kind of changing where the neutral position of vertical is. Like you can see this guy, you know, he wants to lean forward so you could, you know, adjust that. But that would be moving the position, like the centers of these on like um, rotating them and having an alternate plate, which is the reason why I'd want to have this design with like a cartridge that 
would dovetail in so you could um, in the design you know print the rest of the the base but have alternate pieces to print for for mounting these cams uh, but all, all stuff that I'm thinking about and you know um, it's just a question of the amount of filament it would take um, to print you know and the cost of, of uh, the hardware and the extrusions and all, and all this stuff you know something that if I'm not um, going to uh, you know have the, the free time or resources to commit to it I'm, I don't know when I'm going to get it done so but that's just some of the ideas that I've had for the redesign all right, thanks guys. Uh, comment below uh, and let me know, uh, you know, what you think.